It's day two, and I've got a lot of work to do. Today, I'm going to be working on both the axe and the flanges for the mace. I doubt I'll weld anything up yet, but I want to make sure everything's right. Today, I'm trying to take more of a marathon pace. I'm going to slow down, stay focused, work on my method, and get this axe forged out right. This is a home-built tire power hammer. Just got to keep your eye on it. If you do that, it'll take care of you. One of my biggest challenges is going to be weather. It's supposed to rain all afternoon, so I need to keep all my work inside the shop. And I've been working this piece pretty aggressively, so I want to give it a chance to relax, make sure any stress that I've put in it has a chance to even out. My axe has got its basic shape down. I've got the blade long enough. I've got it wide enough. Uh, the eye is almost right. I may do some corrections. And now it's time to just normalize the blade a couple times, let that steel relax again. one of the reasons I really like doing this, because there's a, there's a pinch of magic in everything that we're doing here in the forge. And that just makes it fun. Day five. Today, I'm going to cut down the mace just a little bit, get some weight off of it. It's a little, little unbalanced since I had to cut the axe head down. In order to solve the weight problem, or the balance problem, I'm cutting some weight off of the mace. First step, cut this off with the milling machine, cut these circles out, and then blend it in with a grinder. Let's see if these hole saws will cut this first. OK, here we go. It's not cutting it easy or fast, but it is cut. One down. That's how that works. I think I like the new shape. My new and improved mace. Way balanced, better. Oh, yeah. I think I'm going to do some testing next. It's a little risky to do testing, especially on the last day. Very confident in the weapon. I'm just making sure. Ready to do some testing. I've got some denim, denim pants filled with kitty litter. I've got coconuts. I've got a moose leg bone. Here we go. Ah! There we go. Wow. <laughs> Very cool. Great. We're good. Oh, it passed. I've put the weapon through every kind of torture I possibly can. I can't think of anything that else that they could do to it. Uh, it's out of my hands now. I've done the best I can. I'm not concerned about anything. I'm, I'm just going to have a good time. <laughs>